Hey guys, what's going on? DuffKing56 here, back, continuing this Final Fantasy 13 Let's Play. So let's play! Epic intro is epic. Just kidding, but I like I like that intro. I did. I can't believe we're still in Cocoon. It's kind of creepy. Yay, fighting some pulse works, dude. Reminds me of the, uh. Shoot, the, um. Let's see, what am I even using here? There we go. Reminds me of the Final Fantasy 13 2 demo. <laughs> Except these guys, I'm sure, will be a lot easier. Once we get them staggered and all that. Oh my gosh. Looks like it's gonna take forever. But that's okay. I'm not sure why I have snow in, in my party, actually, at all. Holy shit, I'm taking a lot of damage. Um. Let's get our medic going here. Although these guys should die pretty freaking fast. As you can see, I'm doing doing lots of damage on them. You know, even in my paradigm set, I wonder, I wonder why I have hope here. Kind of weird. All right, let's go. Let's go at it. If he should be dead, then we can start on this guy. He's kind of running away. <laughs> it's kind of weird. <laughs> Either way. Alrighty. These guys aren't too bad to take down once you get them staggered, so... I mean, things have basically kept the same, I think. Wow, he does do quite a, a, a lot of damage, though. So the better, the faster stagger, the better with these guys. I mean, you don't want them spiking you out or anything, especially with the makeup of the party and everything, so... Not too bad, though. This guy's going to be quick to go. And that is that. So we got him. There we go. Okay. So continue on here. That was an easy, easy battle. Five stars. I like it. I like it a lot. Ooh, role development unlocked. Your party members have unlocked the potential to assume all combat roles. From now on, you may also freely select the members of your battle team. To take on a new role, the member must first learn an ability for that role. You can teach a party member new abilities via the Crystarium. Ooh, looks like everyone can play everything now. The fifth arc, Concealed Vestige. tried searching, but they never found a thing. Who'd have thought to look on Cocoon? Right under our noses. Some secret they kept. Those Sanctum guys, what are they up to? The story's not done. There's more. They used to say the Arcs had a more practical purpose. Yeah. Huh. Really? Yeah. To force Lassie to master their shiny new powers. Huh. Okay, so I get it. Dysley's goal is to forge us into stronger weapons. Right. Not Seath, but monsters all the same. <laughs> Think of it as training for fight ahead. Herb's right. Wait. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Ah, uh, the 
these guys. Fun times. Over there. We gotta keep moving. <sighs> All right, well, these guys actually aren't that tough. Just if you give me one quick second here, I want to kind of check what we got here for, for in the party. Um, that's so cool. You can be everything now. Um, Paradigms? Battle team. There we go. Okay, so I kind of want to keep Fang. And let's see. She's a calm sentinel sab. We need a synergist. I kind of like this team a lot. So I'm going to keep that. The only thing I'm going to change is I'm going to give Fang the uh, Ravager, the Ravager roll. Excuse me. Jesus. Fumbling my words here. Uh, I'm going to give her some stuff in the Ravager roll. As you can see, the cost for these things is insanely large. So it's kind of rough um, from the get-go here. We don't have much as it is. Um, I don't even think we can actually learn her first move, unfortunately. Let's see. Yeah, I don't even think we can... Yeah, we can't even learn her first move. Oh, no, she did get fire. Okay, that's good. So now we can we can have a tri-disaster uh, paradigm. And that's kind of the only reason I want to keep her in the party at the moment. Let's see. This is going to be my active paradigm. Combat clinic. No, nope, I wanted medic. Sent Saboteur Synergist, and then that's that one, okay. Now we're gonna have our damage heavy one for our stagger, Commando Commando Ravager, aggression. And this is gonna be our tri disaster for our stagger bar. I kinda like this this loadout here. I'm gonna I'm gonna wait and, and gather more Crystarian points for, for everyone else to, to start leveling them up just because of the fact that it does cost so much. I might spend some time farming uh, here just because of that the simple fact as well. So we're gonna kill these guys. I mean they weren't they weren't that tough in the beginning so we're gonna do our best to uh, take them out and hopefully we won't die. I gotta pay attention to my health. <laughs> that was my problem before and uh, I think it'll suit us well. Getting all the training here. I'm not sure how long I'm going to stay here. Uh, obviously for the Let's Play, I'm not going to stay here very long. But I actually might come back and farm if I don't hit another cutscene. Because, um, I don't know, I haven't gone through this area, obviously. So, I honestly don't know what's, what, what's going to happen. It's, oh, we got to get heals. Uh, this one. Yeah. Cure everyone, cure everyone, cure everyone. Come on, Hope. Cure someone. <laughs> Please. Thanks. She's got that new entrench move that we had. Okay, let's take out this Pulse Work Knight. And uh, we can work on the other one. There we go. She just stable stabilized her stagger bar. We're going to switch to Tri Disaster really quick after this. And watch how. We'll just watch the stagger bar just get raped. It'd be so nice. Yeah, look at that. That's just. That's just very nice. Um, let's get our dual commander Ravager here. Finish him off quite quickly. As you can see, he just he, he never had a chance. That aggression works really well against the the pulse work soldiers. Uh, as I can see now, just it'll be good. And we're getting some great materials here, so it, it's definitely going to be worth our while. Let's see what's down, what's down here. It's definitely going to be worth our while to uh, take everyone out and maybe get. Uh, I wanted to get a. Uh, Freaking preemptive on them, but that's okay. Um, yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be worth our while to take everyone out in the end. So that's what we're going to do. I don't like his AOE attack, though. That bothers me. <laughs> that's just personal preference, though. Oh god, my tri disaster class looks so cool. And his stagger bar. Look at his stagger bar. It's like pretty sustained for having three ravagers on him. Um, it was good that we had one attack turn when. We weren't Ravagers, I think. Yeah, so uh, Fang could commando him out. That was good. It was real nice and quick. I like it. I like clean battles. They're very nice. Uh, let's catch this guy. Yes, we did. Take these guys out right quick. And then see if we can stagger them both here with just our Thundara. Did we get the other one? Oh, I think we did actually get the other one staggered. That's good. Very good. Gouda cheese. Yeah. 
Fangle take him out? And, oh, I guess we didn't. Uh, he was flashing yellow, orange, and, and I figured we did, but... Unfortunately, we did not get him anywhere staggered. <laughs> As you can see, Ben stagger bar is evidence, but that's okay. Um, we'll switch to our Tri Disaster, and uh, we'll fix that problem really quickly. I like having a, a third Ravager in the party. It's very nice. And uh, we go to Aggression, and uh, he will now cease to exist after two attack turns. So that's good. Bye bye. Okay, good. There we go. I'm gonna go down here, and I saw a couple chests in the cutscene, so that's what I'm gonna.